Hello, brother. Hello, brother Anthony. Hey. You know, we're in a new month. It's called the month of November. Now, in the States, in the month of November, every other year, every two years, we have election cycle. You know, out of all the election cycles they have, you know, it's kind of interesting because people say that, ah, you know, we have a democracy. But most people don't participate in their democracy. They don't know what that is. They think democracy is voting every four years or every two years. In your case, every five years or whatever. They have your stuff in between. Mm -hmm. But here's the thing. There's a thing. One of the worst. Because, you know, I'm doing, um, I'm doing youth participatory action research. The important word in there is participatory. One of those big words. I like that word, participatory. Mm -hmm. But you were supposed to have a participatory democracy. I'm talking about from we, I mean, from the states. But that's spread all over the world. Everybody talking about democracy, democracy, democracy. But what kind of democracy? And what does it mean for a participatory democracy? So because if you vote for president, it doesn't mean nothing. I mean, you have to vote for the guy before he became president, you know, when he was the, what, the senator or the, or the, or the, or the some congressman or, or the governor or the state senator. You say state senator, but that's like your counselors, you know. But here's the thing. Most people, they don't vote for their state senators and stuff like that. I mean, you know, they might click something off, they just do whatever. They don't pay any attention to that. But what happens is most of your stuff is happening on the council level or the state senator level, the state assembly level, the state level. The, 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 the big government, they, they, they play games, they make a lot of money, that's it. But all those laws, because, you know, at least I can speak for the United States, there are 50 different states. It's the United States of America. In each state, they can put whatever law they want. And who makes those laws? A bunch of people that have the time to go in there and run for election and they get elected. And then nobody knows who they are, they just stay there. Mm. <laughs> it's a, it's, I mean, people talk about, for instance, the shadow government. Well, that's the shadow government. I mean, it's not the shadow government. It's the real government right out front, but nobody pays any attention to them. And those are the guys that makes all the law, makes all the problems, makes all the solutions if they want. So there's the problem. We don't participate in democracy. When they want to import democracy to you, they don't want you to participate. They want they, they don't want you they don't want you to do anything. Maybe four years, five years, two years, and you can vote. But then what happens in between that? You don't know what's going on. You mm -hmm. ain't checking the stuff. <laughs> they make all kinds of laws against your interests. You don't even pay attention. And it doesn't start with state, it starts with something like the school board. You're checking on what's happening in your child's school, things like that. And people don't want to participate in that level. I mean, they'll participate going to church or something like that. But they won't participate in anything else aside from going to church once or twice a week or once or twice a year. Otherwise, they don't pay attention. They, they treat they treat parties like church but once every whatever years. <laughs> we'll go hang out, and then we'll start complaining because we don't pay attention. Well, problem. Hmm. And the world's not getting any better because we keep on not paying attention. We get distracted by other things. We don't participate. We to participate in our own demise is what we participate in. Just some food for thought. I don't know, it sounds kind of dramatic, me saying that, you know, blah, 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 blah. And I am an audio, audio dramatist, so it probably is dramatic. But for now, it's just a dispatch. It's a dispatch from the arch director emeritus. So that would be me, T, from the Madison's taking the train to Tibet, letting you know what I only suspect. Mm -hmm.